Hey, this is Dragonfeather, and I'm here to be doing a video on my new altar. Um, for the S, but yesterday I ended up getting a new altar that's made out of wood, not plastic like my other one was. Um, and it was a gift from my sister. Um, I hope you guys had a good blood moon, by the way. It was pretty, pretty awesome, and, um, I'll tell you guys a little bit about that in a second. Um, but yeah, I, I got a new altar, and it's really nice, and it's so lovely, and it's so much easier to work with now, and it's not all ruckety and noisy and messy, so I can't wait to show you guys, and it has my sound set up on it, um, which is slightly different from my normal one, because um, I don't change the altar cloth for my Salon, uh altar. So yeah, without further ado, here you guys go! Um, so this is my new altar. Here, let me get some light for you guys. Um, there we go. Uh, so this is my new altar, and uh, I won't show you the bottom yet, but this is my setup. It has my skull and some bones on there for Samhain, um, and then my little spider uh, for Samhain as well. And I'm going to put more things on um, on it throughout the uh, time that I have uh, before Samhain. I haven't done my Samhain shopping yet, so uh, hopefully I get to do that next weekend, which will be very exciting. Um, but yeah, so this is what it looks like right now. And then underneath... Um, is really, uh, really convenient because my books can fit in here, and this was a really big problem for me, because my books, like, as you can see, my altars are here, but my books are way over there, um, so it was a really big problem, and I couldn't really use my books, and it was, like, this really big traumatic hassle and stuff, so it was, um, quite annoying, but now I have all my books in there, and I have, like, my Isis statue, and my goddess statue, and my crystal ball, and the book way back there, that's my, um, Book of Shadows, and I have, like, my, my runes, my crystal clusters up here, and my wand, my travel altar, and my motor and pestle. And it's just, it's, I don't know, I love having this open space right here because it's just so perfect. And it's absolutely wonderful. And I'm, like, using my lamp as a lighting fixture, it's pretty, pretty awesome because it is not, um, daytime, so I have to use light. Um, I opened it with my foot like a badass. So here's the inside and I just have my candles and incense in here and candle holders and like certain things that I use in rituals. Um, like my, I have my jug in here and then I have some more things and it's, it's all nice and organized instead of it how it was last time. Um, but yeah, there's that. And then I was able to organize all of this over here. You guys know that this used to be all my crystals in a really random pile and clump and it was just not organized and the energies of them were getting all off and so it was awful and uh using my foot again like an awesome person um i have all my shells in here um i have as you can see that's my plate that i use in ritual some dishes and uh some uh two wands that i fin haven't finished making but yeah mostly that is just all my shells and figurines and then in here is um all my ritual tools like um divination tools mostly i have all my runes in here my tarot cards um, I have, uh, my ritual clothing in here, and as you can see, there's a lot of room in there, so I can fit more things in there as time goes on. But really, it's that, it's quite that simple, and it's quite, quite wonderful. I really enjoy the setup, sorry for the movement. Um, that was my old altar, I don't know if I showed you already. Uh, but yeah, it was all plastic and gross and icky, and now it's this beautiful thing. So yeah. Um, yesterday for the blood moon... Uh, I did not actually do a ritual because I was so tired from helping my sister all day that I just literally fell asleep and passed out. Uh, but I was planning on doing a ritual and that didn't happen. But I think it was better that it didn't, although I had a wonderful day. I had, I got to spend so much time with my sister and my friend Jordan. And we, uh, we were just all up, out and about and then I ended up getting to see um, some of the dogs of my uncles that I haven't seen in a long time and I was playing catch with them and fetch with them out in the full moon So it was really magical and just absolutely wonderful But yeah, um, I'd love to see what you guys did or hear, hear what you guys did um, For your full moon if you did anything um, so you guys can leave those below and I'd love to hear them uh, But yeah, this was more of just like a fun video uh, just showing you guys and stuff like that um, and I hope you guys are starting to get ready for Samhain. It's the new year, and I'm very happy and excited about it. Uh, but yeah, I, um, hope you guys enjoyed watching. Um, any questions or comments, leave them below and let me know, and I'll get back to you. And until next time, blessed be, and bye!